YouTubers High Score Challenge and the game this time is Ghost in the Shell on the PlayStation 1. I'm just getting over um, a, a cold really so you'll have to bear with me. Um, it's, it's a little bit bunged up but um, well, well on the mend unfortunately. Um, so yeah this game, um, yeah, when, when, when I saw it was a PlayStation game uh, and it announced I was, I was slightly worried because um, I haven't tried using uh, PlayStation emulators before, and uh, my worry was my, my weedy little laptop uh, wouldn't be able to run it. But um, uh, I'm pleased to say it run, runs absolutely fine um, yeah, using the Duck Station um, emulator. Um, yeah, really nifty. Um, it seemed really straightforward to set up, and um, it seems to have lots of nice options and things. So, um, yeah, very pleased with that. Um, the, the game itself, Ghost in the Shell, um, is what one I think I remember seeing in the magazines um, back in the day. Um, yes, I do, do love a bit of PS1. Um, I've got, got a PlayStation myself. Um, s s still got one of the original ones. And um, yeah, this this, this game I, th I think I remember seeing it in the magazines, but but never um, ne never actually got to play it. Um, very very visually impressive. You know, lots of three D stuff happening here. And, you know, those kind of like. Um, Transparent camouflage effects, yeah, they're, they're, they're really impressive as well, yeah, especially for its time. Just, just trying to think what what other games might have used similar effects back back in the time back in the day, but um, it's, it's only it still looks impressive to me um, even playing it today. Um, so with this uh, challenge, it's we're playing the first six levels, uh, missions one to six, and uh, aim is to get the highest score. Uh, you can get a quite a hefty time bonus, um, up to 100,000. I got 45,000 there, which was uh, good enough for me, really. I got, got a nice 50,000 shield bonus, which, which I, was, I was happy with as well. Um, yeah, moving on to the second level here. Now, although you get a time bonus, I changed tactic uh, for this particular level. To get the time bonus on, on this level, you you, you kind of need to absolutely just like bomb it through the level, you know, just like full, full speed head, pretty much like running really past everything. And I was finding, finding like even if I was doing it as quickly as I possibly could, like I, I still, it's still very difficult to get get a decent time bonus. So instead of charging through it like a maniac, I've decided to um, just do the so-called normal way, where you just Taking out the enemies, um, keeping my shield uh, topped up, and basically made a conscious decision to um, just, just just go for the shield bonus um, and uh, any kill bonuses as well from from taking out the enemies on, on the way. So, uh, but yeah, lovely, lovely little uh, night vision um, effects here as well. So uh, again, a bit, a bit of very impressive graphics. Yeah, the 3D as well. Like uh, you can, you can sort of scale the walls and things, and yeah, you can sort of crawl upside down on the roofs and stuff. So that's uh, also very impressive. And I might as well mention at this point. Yeah, Ghost and Shells, um, a, a movie I've I've really been wanting to see. Um, kind of like uh, yeah, I kind of remember it sort of being quite a big release uh, at the time. Um, yeah, I've always wanted to see it, but um, unfortunately haven't been able to yet. Uh, but um, yeah, the, the, the cutscenes in this uh, are, are also sort of very, very impressive and just just make me want to watch it more. Really. Um, talking of which, with with the cutscenes, yeah, they are very nice in this game. Um, but yeah, just, just just for the sake of putting my run together, I, I have skipped them. Um, what, what I would like to do at some point is. Yeah, just p p play this game completely, start start to finish, and yeah, so like so, so soak in the cutscenes as well. But yeah, for, for, the, for this challenge, I've kind of just been uh, f focused on, uh, yep, d doing everything as quick quickly or as uh, uh, without getting hit um, as as best as possible. So t took out all the enemies. Just uh, nipping back to energy top up. If 
for moving on to the final boss. We have uh, kind of accidentally sort of went, went upon the walls there and accidentally found another enemy. And, uh, to the boss. <clears throat> I was looking at a video after um, after I'd recorded this, and um, it actually seems like just, just shooting it with your normal machine gun might, might might actually be a bit quicker. So, not don't think I'm doing myself any any, any favours here with the uh, m m missile blasts. Those missiles, they kind of like you charge, charge up your, you know, hold down the fire button and the charge them up before releasing. But yeah, p please just look out that boss without, um, uh, w w without taking any shield damage. So, and I got my grenade bonus there as well. So I, I sacrificed the time bonus um, for um, the nice shield and grenade bonus. The bigger points would have been to get a full time bonus, but. Um, yeah, that, uh, as it has, I was, I was really struggling on, on that level to do that. Okay, uh, onto a more open-ended level. Um, got to take out these whatever, whatever is, explosive barrels or something um, before, before the time expires. I do like the music in this game as well. Very, uh, very good. So I kind of remember roughly where the barrels are. I sometimes still get lost and things. Um, a couple of sneaky ones appear. Tr tr trick is like a, it's kind of like um, almost like, like, like a reddish sort of like t a tower. You need to climb to get them. I, th I think it's the same in this area as well. Like if you're wondering what, where to go up, it's kind of like, like the ones with the sort of sl slightly red frames. And there's one tucked away in here, which. Yeah, first time playing it, so I couldn't find it anyway, just going on, on top and all around the building, but missed that opening. Probably could have done a slightly quicker route, I imagine. Um, it's, it's kind of just like films are just like that dashing around and then, um, yeah, so like uh, y using the radar, but yeah, I'm sure, sure there's a much more efficient route uh, which, which we could have used. I, th I think the sound, um, unfortunately, on the, on the capture might, might, might have gone a bit gobbledygook so um, apologies if uh, that's not, not coming through cleanly Took a couple of hits, but um, not not bad, not bad. Yeah, 
pretty pleased with that all in all. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, the, yeah, the, the audio does, does not seem to be coming through well. Yeah, nice, uh, kind of like on, on rails chase bit. Um, you can you, you can kind of like move around a, a, a bit as well, like using strafe buttons, move move the boat sort of like left and right. Just a bit of press mines and hazards to watch out for, which I just put plowed straight into there. Yeah, again, again, very, very visually impressive. Like, um, yeah, you know, I know some some PS One games d do look good, but I, 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 th I think the way this this, this moves and yeah, there's these sort of water effects and stuff. And yeah, it just, just all, all, all looks very nice, very, very impressive, uh, and, and it runs it runs pretty smoothly. Taking quite a few hits here, but uh, yeah. I managed to take it out alright. So, yeah, d decent time bonus, not a great shield bonus, unfortunately, but um, yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty, pretty, pretty pleased with that. I mean, it's, it's certainly in this run, like, um, yeah, there's room for improvement, like, um, after I'd put in this run, it's kind of, yeah, it's certain areas I could definitely get, get a few, f f few more thousand points, you know, tens of thousands of points here, here and there, um, but when I, when I sort of did start playing it again, it was kind of like, um, uh, yeah, I, there's just just things like yeah, I, I, I thought I was being quick on level one, but I just, I just w w w wasn't getting the time bonus, and, um, and then, then I kind of just got, got hit too many times on level two and stuff, and it was, it was just like um, I don't, it, it kind of got to that point where it would have been having to put in some, quite a lot of work just to get 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 a little bit more. I mean, yeah, yeah, it would have good good well make a difference, but. Um, it's kind of like, a, yeah, it's, I, 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 I thought I'd call it, like, a, I was pleased enough with it, this by the end. Yeah, on, on this level, like, a nice, um, that, that, that's kind of like camouflage effect again, where this this person thing you're chasing after sometimes goes invisible, but, but you can just about see uh, where, where they're running to. This level as well, it's a bit more forgiving with the time bonus. Um, yeah, you don't need to absolutely bomb it through like um, do on some of the other levels. Uh, 
you, you can kind of like as long as you don't just look. As long as you're not too slow, then you, you, you pretty, pretty, pretty much get, get the full bonus easy enough. It's a bit, bit of a silly hit I took there. at all this boss really just kind of like jumps around a bit Ooh, just so that's a take hit yeah, but I think I think really as long as you stay fairly mobile and safe enough and you don't get too close like that when I, when I jump in the air yeah full time bonus yeah because it could have a bit, bit sloppy taking some hits there, and yeah, could, could have got an improved shield bonus there, I'm sure. Okay, yep, yeah, another, another chase, uh, ch chase scene. Um, I ended up going this way. I, th um, I, I, I don't know if one's better than the other. Um, at first, I was going down the left, but I'm, I'm not sure if I can like, get the same pickup opportunities or not. Um, I, I, I kind of just ended up settling on on this this route. Sure, sure. Happens if you f fall between the gaps. Uh, instant death, maybe. Don't know. Okay, and onto the boss. Okay, uh, that's the end of mission six. Not bad time. Is eight two eight nine hundred. So that was my score at the end of the six missions. Um, so that so concludes my run. Um, I think that, yeah, that's it. So uh, bye for now then.